can swing over now. Place is flooded. Top of a doorway over here. That'll work. Okay. Easy does it. Now, what? Got water in my ears. I hate that. But I wouldn't give her a towel. <clears throat> my God. Are you seeing this? You know, at this point, I've run out of words. Holy goddamn shit. Nice work. What on earth is this place? A throne room. Place to hide a magnificent bejeweled tusk. Let's hope so. Stairs going up. Not there most be broken. I'll have to find another way up. Oh, shit. I think I know what it is. Bet we're gonna need that disc soon. Exactly. Well, not much we can do until we find a sob. Or until we find us. Nothing to climb this way. Over here, Nadine. Copy that. Now we're getting somewhere. I see a few more of those cranks around the chamber. Hmm. Now what's that up there? One thing at a time. Right. I'll give this a spin. Hand is moving. Be more specific. Right hand. Lower. Right hand. 
maybe it's because this statue's enormous. But I just now noticed Shiva's got a King Cobra for a necklace. That's Vasuki, a king of the Nagas. Entities that take the form of the King Cobra. It shows his control over fear and death. Mm. Cobras were always my favorite snake. Don't think I have a favorite snake. Well, there's got to be more to this. Just need to figure out what it is. Coming? I'm going to search the other side. Okay. <sighs> ah. There's another crank up ahead. I better get a move on. No going back now. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, good suggestion. Ah, oh, that was a close one. Nearly destroyed my pants. Wow. I can see my house from here. I did. I'll be right down.
Here we go. Okay, I've got this one. And I've got this one. <laughs> Teamwork! Bringing down Shiva's drum. Uh oh. This one's like the trident. Time to move. Come on, jump to the drum. It's an hourglass shaped drum. <laughs> Oh shit, here we go! Hang on! And now we turn the water on for this side. And here we go. We've got water running down both sides. Look. Oh. Shall we? Is that it? We'll find out in a moment. Light is shining on that statue across the way. Oh, I guess we're not done. When the Hoysala want to protect something, they don't do it halfway. Come on. What? What you said, back in that place with all the statues and axes. Things always come in threes. Three points of a trident, the light split into three beams, and Shiva's third eye. Do you know about Shiva's third eye? Yeah. Wisdom. Mm-hmm. And destruction. He only opens it to impart one or the other. Oh, hope it's wisdom. Yeah, not with our luck.
Well, shit. This one's busted. Let me see. Hang on. You got that? Yeah. There. You make a phenomenal statue. Get over there. This thing's heavy. Right. Okay, that did something. So I can put this down? No, wait for it. What's happening? I can't see from over here. Uh, hold still for just a sec. All this water, it's a cleansing ritual. What's happening? Oh, you can put down the mirror now. Oh, shit. They found us! Get you ready? Shit! <laughs> oh, no, no, no! no. was quite the fall. You had me worried. Come, it's time for a reunion. He wouldn't give you up, despite my efforts to persuade him. Oh, Sam! Jesus. Hey, you made it. Dude. It's all right. He is like a girl. Is that right? How about we get these cuffs off and I'll show you how girls hit? What the hell is she doing here? You said find help, I got help. Yeah. I must admit, you are quite the schemer. 
First you steal my desk, then you have your expert run me around in circles, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Perhaps there's a little Indian blood in you after all. Let's finish what we started. All right, all right. <clears throat> so, Nadine Ross. Don't talk to me. <laughs> I was gonna say, you look good. Was I not clear? What's that smell? Oh, I'm sorry. I haven't exactly had access to running water and soap recently. All the people you could have brought with you. <laughs> she saved my ass more than once, you know. You do remember that uh, she also tried to kill Nathan and I many, many times. And to be fair, you two tried to do the same to her. Yeah, but that, that's not the point. The point is that the second we turn our backs, there will be a knife in there. I can hear every word you're saying. I know! I trust her. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I guess I'm just a little bit irked that we are walking away with nothing. But I guess you know what that's like, right? <laughs> oh! oh, my. Real classy, thank you. Time and place, children. More that came from. Bike racks after school. Ugh. Just hurry up. the kings have one final test. Looks like you won't be needing us, though, so we'll just be on oh, our on way. On the contrary. Surely you know the story. <laughs> you see, Shiva gave Parashuram the mighty axe that struck Ganesh in the face, bringing Shiva's son, one of the greatest of the gods, to his knees. Another casualty of war. Don't. Yeah, seriously, Chloe, he's just gonna kill! Uh, he's right. But if you refuse, you will watch them die, inch by inch. All right! <laughs> Chloe, don't! Parashurama. <clears throat> Parashurama and Ganesh. What now? Chloe, don't you give this schmuck what he wants. Quiet! Testing 
patience. He's yielding. It's going to fall. Quiet! Ganesh, quite an obstacle you've placed in my path. Unexpected. Holy shit, she's got balls, huh? I, I don't understand. It's an idiot. That's because you've got it all twisted, my friend. Ganesh allowed himself to be struck by the axe. That makes no sense. <laughs> Not to a selfish prick, no. You <laughs> see, Ganesh could have defeated Parashurama easily. But if he had, that would have made Shiva's axe look weak. Powerless. Ganesh sacrificed himself to preserve his father's honor. See, even she gets it, not a drop of Indian blood in her. Magnificent, isn't it? Oh, what? Nothing to say now? Oh, if you like, I can tell you where to stick it. <laughs> well, my friends, I would love to kill you myself, but we must not anger the gods, for you have brought me a great fortune. Okay, then, what are you doing? You're going to flood the chamber. I will miss you. Come on, is this really necessary? You know, nothing is ever truly destroyed. Only purified and reborn. Just shoot us and get it over with. Right? As the water fills your lungs, you will have time to reflect on the choices that brought you here. Perhaps in your next lives, you will fare better. Prick. I don't know about you guys, but I got a lot of regrets swimming around in my head right now. Tell me about it. 
I was really looking forward to kicking your ass again. Hey, you know, I'm not exactly thrilled about drowning next to you either. Could you give it a rest, guys? I'm trying to concentrate. What are you doing? A little preparation goes a long way. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. Smoking. <coughs> Think they saw us? Let's hope not. How the hell did Asaf get that helicopter? Maybe it's the buyers. What do you mean? Just overheard Asaf talking about <coughs> heading to the old rail yard. Something about an arms deal. He's selling the tusk. So much for preserving his culture. Hey, just a second. Listen, uh. <clears throat> Back there. Thanks for... Professional courtesy. <laughs> of course. So, are we good? No. I yeah, figured. If we hurry, we can intercept them before they make the sale. Huh. And there's our ride. <gasps> These are nice. There. Railroad tracks. Stop here. Uh. 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 I saw we'll have lookouts throughout the area. This door on the side of caution. Right, right, right. And then we lose the tusk. You're welcome to stay behind. I'm just saying. Like. All right, all right, all right, right. Less talking, more walking. So all that time in Asov's care, and you couldn't get any intel on the bias? Uh, well, I tried. Asov's a cagey one. Almost never talks shop in front of me. Can't imagine why. Hey, he trusted me enough to believe I was an expert in all this hoisala crap. Hoisala. Yeah, the two. By the way, thanks for keeping him busy for us. Yeah, you know, I wanted to buy you some time in case you were coming to get me. Of course we were. Seriously, thanks. I thought I was a goner. I wouldn't let that happen. Your brother would never let me hear the end of it. 